हाय गाइस वेलकम टू कोडा टीजन लैब दिस इज वीडियो नंबर 31 फॉर मल्टी वेंडर ई कॉमर्स वेबसाइट इन जेंगो विद रिएक्ट जेएस इन दिस वीडियो वी विल वर्क ऑन द रिपोर्ट्स लेआउट राइट इन आवर प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव वर्कड ऑन द ऑर्डर्स एंड कस्टमर्स आई विल आल्सो ऐड हियर वन मोर एक्शन एंड दैट विल बी द ऑर्डर्स व्हेन वी क्लिक ऑन द ऑर्डर्स देन वी कैन सी द ऑल ऑर्डर्स ऑफ द पर्टिकुलर कस्टमर राइट सो लेट्स सी Uh, first of all let's modify this then we will create the reports layout right so let's open the customer layout so source component and uh, seller and then uh, we have a customers right and then we will add here one more action so we are adding remove from list i think let's keep it but uh, i'm not sure we need this uh, action or not okay so this will be let's say primary and uh, we will say orders right and here we are let's copy this and paste it after the after this button so it will look like this now let's add margin start 1 margin start 1 okay so now it's fine let's keep it after the before the remove list so it will be standard way okay yeah here yeah. so now it will look like this so remove move this class to the second one right then remove this here we are okay now let's work on the report section so in the report section a report can be let's uh, create the report section then i will discuss with you okay so let's create the function let's say a reports dot js function reports export default reports right and then here we have return we will return report so currently i am just going to add the seller dashboard section right so let's copy this and paste it here what are the things here the seller sidebar we need okay so let's paste the sidebar okay now let's add this in a route so come uh, app.js app.js then we have here reports right and then we will we need to import the report component and reports and here we have a reports right so when we click on this okay we need to modify the sidebar okay so reports oh no this is change password this is reports right so uh, in reports what we need to do later we will add some graphs right but let's uh, add currently let's add a okay total product let's say monthly report monthly reports right and uh, here we will say view okay let's make it a button class button button info okay and uh, button sm right let's make it this so this is monthly report all right so monthly report and uh, we can say the daily reports okay so this will be let's first one is a daily report right and this is this will be the monthly report okay daily monthly or we can say the year wise okay yearly
okay uh, what it is all right so we need to start a div why this is happening mm, copy this paste it here okay and then we have a paste it here we have here okay so we have a daily monthly and yearly report daily monthly and we have yearly report right later we will add here the sections uh, for the chart right so we can use chart.js or we can use apex chart whatever we need we will use that right so we have almost completed our uh, vendor panel one more thing we need to do we need to include two more things uh, two more things are a profile and change password same as we have in a customer panel right so if you go to the uh, customer panel right so where is the customer panel in the customer we have a sidebar okay let's include this and in our next step we will create the uh, this is our change password and this is our profile right so we'll copy this right and then we will paste it here so this will be our seller this is change password and profile right so this is profile and change password let's create this let's create this quickly so we will complete that profile so new paste save and we will say profile vendor profile vendor profile.js right and then in the app we will add it here and we will say vendor profile okay and then we will add here seller profile and this will be vendor profile right so vendor profile and uh, in the sidebar we have profile okay now let's uh, copy the change password so change password let's copy this create here <coughs> vendor change password vendor change password okay and uh, what we need to do okay in the app uh, we will fetch this vendor change password in here okay so this is change password okay and this is vendor change password okay so why this is okay vendor profile in the vendor profile we have a sidebar but it should be seller sidebar right okay and then uh, in the change password the same thing seller sidebar seller sidebar right why this is saying oh yeah. so profile okay and change password right so everything is completed in the customer panel and in the vendor panel from the next video we will start our api okay we will start to fetching the data and we will see that how we will connect the rest api and the react and we will also implement the permissions and we will make our website more functionable more functionality okay so thank you so much for watching this video Please stay tuned with the Core Artisan Lab and please support me and uh, subscribe this channel, like this video 
and you can also download project from projectsplaza.com here i am uploading uh, projects in various technology like python uh, php javascript right in the in the python i am uploading the project in django mainly focused in django so you can just download here these are not uh, absolutely free but small price so this is also a small you know this is also very uh, big uh, support for me from your side so please uh, download the project from here okay and uh, share with your friends and if you have not subscribed this channel then please subscribe and watch this playlist and if you have any query anything then please add add in the comment section and uh, i hope uh, this is these things are helpful for you for your learning journey okay so thank you so much for watching the video let's meet in the next video thank you